I could solve this using the distributive property, but I'm going to use the second method, which is going to involve dividing both sides in their entirety by five. Now, because five is being multiplied by the whole thing in parentheses, when I cancel it out, that's going to leave me on the left with simply the x minus three. So now I just have x minus three is equal to 10 divided by five. Of course, I need to divide by five on both sides. 10 divided by five is going to give me two. So I now have that x minus three is equal to two. And to solve this is fairly simple now. All I need to do is add three on both sides. And once I do that, on the left-hand side, it's going to cancel. And that's just going to leave me with x as the minus 3 and the plus 3 cancel. And on the right-hand side, I get 2 plus 3, which is 5. So my conclusion is that x equals 5. I'm just going to conclude by plugging it into the original equation. And that gives me 5 minus 3, which is 2. And yes, 5 times 2 does equal 10, which is what I was hoping for. And that does check out. So I can conclude that x equals 5 is, in fact, a correct solution. Hope that helps. Thank you very much.